What's up guys? Welcome back. This time, okay, so this time, this time, I hope that we're going to get past this Articuno. I've done some changes, so I, one, linked my moves for me and the Cyndaquil. And not just that, but also, I got us some items, so we were both holding special bands. I found a stamina band, and I got two power bands. I was going to record going through the whole thing, but I was like, I figured you've already seen me go through it enough. I'm just going to start it off at the Articuno and hope for the best. But yeah, I went up in level. I'm 21. I forget what the Mudkip's at. Probably 22 or 23 because the Mudkip was always ahead of me. But yeah, so I'm higher level. We got items, linking moves. So I'm hoping this time we're moving through. And also, like I said, I don't want to waste any more time. Just beat this and move on because I've already wasted tons of time trying to beat this damn thing. But yeah. But alright. So... Here we go. Let's see if we can finally do it. All right. So we're going to start off with smoke screen like always. And gravel rock. I also found Roar, but Roar is pretty useless, so we're going to sell that later for money. Yeah, alright, so let's throw this. Alright, that's one. Okay. Let's go. Okay, I got two hits. Wow, Water Gun does 48. I've been doing freaking tackles the whole time, stupidly. Okay, so that's that. Now, ooh, I got a good feeling about this. Ooh, 125. That's how you know that we went up. Because look at that. Look at that. He's 23. Yup. 125. It's crazy. And that's just the ember. All right. Got to hit him with the smoke screen again. And you saw that attack did almost nothing. It only did 15. So let's... And it's burnt. Okay. Ooh, good thing. Uh, well, we can't use much slap. Well, it won't lower accuracy anymore, but we're still good. All right, so let's just keep hitting it. Seventy-nine. Ooh, and we did it. That was so easy compared to the other times. Man, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Man, probably, you guys are probably saying, like, man, you you fucking suck. Like, we could have taken this shit out instantly first try, but nope. All right, so here we go. Finally beat it. Please, Articuno. We have to get through, no matter what it takes. Please, let us pass. No, I cannot allow you passage. Why? Why can't we pass? The frigid forests air. It has warmed considerably in recent times. Warmed up? I'm still freezing, but... The flow of frigid air has been disturbed in the forest. Snow has started to melt. Snow is melting. Snow that has never melted before. This has never happened, even once. Then you appeared in the forest. Is this not your doing? We don't have anything to do with that. It's a coincidence. Please, Articuno, hear me out. It isn't our fault that the snow started melting here. It's not just here. Natural calamities are taking place everywhere right now. The forest's frigid airflow would have been disturbed even if we hadn't come. Is that all? You expect me to believe that? Why? Wow. Enough of your foolish talk. Prepare for your end. Stop it. I was like, if you want them, we'll give them some more. Ooh, Absol. Uh, Absol? There is nothing false in what they said. Calamities are indeed occurring in nature, nature everywhere. 
Is... is that true? Yes. I have the ability to sense natural disasters. The calamities taking place now are of a special nature. Never experienced such before. So, there are calamities besides this? Fine. I will choose to believe you. You may pass. Articuno! However, ah, you must try to prevent the calamities from spreading. I'm counting on you. Yup, we promise, Articuno. Phew, that was too close. Thank you. You saved us. Rather than saying thanks, focus on stopping the calamities before they worsen. If they are left unchecked, worse will befall us. My instinct warns me so. Mm. I sense the terrible power of the natural calamities. I was led here by my feelings of foreboding. Foreboding? I think foreboding. Foreboding just makes no sense. I think it would be best if we combined forces. I will join you. Huh? You will? Really? Really. To put an end to the calamities, cooperation is vital. Let me lend you my powers. <laughs> Thank you, Absol. Hey, we got a new person on our team. Ooh. Here, I got just the name. Because I say Absol's a bad omen, so why not? And so, after getting through the frosty forest, Elfie's team headed further north. The more they advanced, the harsher the conditions became. Oh, we finally got past that. Should have got past that way sooner. This icy mountain path seems to go on forever. We've walked a long way here. Flamas looks exhausted too. We've been running all this time out of desperation. What's in store for us ahead? Are we really doing the right thing? Burr, this is too cold. There's nothing but snow now. The scenery's been the same for a while. I wonder if we're really making progress. Hey, Alfie, I was thinking. I think we've come to a place that's empty except for us. I have this feeling there's nothing ahead of here, even if we keep moving. And I'm getting exhausted. We too. What's going to happen to us? Don't worry, we'll be fine. Sure, that's right. There isn't any point in wondering about what might happen. Not after coming this far. Sorry, Elfie. I was just feeling sorry for myself. I have faith in you, Elfie. That's what brought me here. And that's not changing. I still have faith in you, Elfie. I'll keep going wherever you go. Yes, Falamas trusts me without any doubt. I can't afford to be indecisive. I have to believe in myself more. What? What was that? D dizzy? Or what? Huh? Is something wrong? Alfie? 
Finally. Finally, you have arrived. Someone. Someone is talking to me? Flamas? No, this voice isn't Flamas. This voice, I've heard it somewhere. Finally. You have arrived. I've been waiting for you. I got Guard of War. I am so glad. Finally, we get to meet. You're what? Alfie, is something the matter? Why are you talking to yourself? I cannot be seen by others. I am visible only to you. A little further ahead, there is a jagged mountain range topped by Mount Freeze. Inside its peak, Ninetales lives. Ninetales? Ninetales awaits your arrival. Beware. Oh, wait! Hey, Alfie! Alfie! What's the matter? What happened? Oh, so something like that happened? Card of War appeared to you? That's why you were looking so stunned earlier. I'm amazed though. Ninetales isn't just a legend, it really exists. And that nine tails is up at that peak. <laughs> Alfie, all the effort we put into getting here, it's finally going to bear fruit. We'll meet nine tails and get the truth. We'll finally get rid of the suspicions others have about you, Alfie. Awesome. Listen, don't be so worried. It will be all right. It's only natural that you would be scared of meeting Ninetales. The heartless human who abandoned Guard of War. It may be you. I can understand how you could think that. But that's impossible. You're not that human, I'm sure. How can you say that? Well, there was a time when I had some doubts. But now, I wonder why. I really don't know why. But it's alright. Alfie, you're a really good sort. I thought it was a sport. You know, before, when I first got the idea to start a rescue team, I met you in the tiny woods. Now that I think about it, there was something different about you. It is strange, isn't it? But Alfie, I believe in you. Anyway, we'll know the truth when we get to the peak. Alfie, let's do our best. All right. So let's store anything that we may need to store. So roar. Okay, so we both got special band, so we don't need that. Let's see how many orange berries we got. Two. We don't need this many orange berries, so get rid of these two orange berries. Stamina band. Uh, we got two max elixirs. Um, I think we're good like this. gonna say really quick and then we'll continue on through this hopefully it's not too many floors we'll see mount freeze okay let's go let's do our best to reach the peak all right so when i was like leveling up i went through the like the alternate one and it just literally takes you back to where you start whoa did a lot of damage. Oh, I forgot about uh, Iron Thorns. And we found a Reviver Seed. Yes. I totally forgot about Iron Thorns. So they're like gravel rocks, but instead of like, 
it's, it's different. I think you can only throw them straight. You can't throw them like the rocks. But yeah, those are much stronger than the gravel rocks. I almost forgot about those. So that's good. We found some. I'm assuming it's going to be the same. I don't want to deal with that shell gun. We're just going to keep going. It's just an apple. Probably it's the same amount of floors. I keep forgetting that the Absol's in our team every time we like go to a new dungeon. No, no a new floor. Like I keep thinking that it's going to attack me, but it's not because it's on the team. That solo came out of nowhere. We haven't leveled up in a while. I'm, I'd say we're about due for a level up. Well, pause this, the Cyndaquil, because Cyndaquil levels up always before me. Oh, Petrascarp. Oh, that's pretty good. Uh, we should have gave the... The band, the other band to the Absol. Damn, I just barely realized that. Since he's going to be with us, might as well give him one of the... The power bands, but it's too late now. Next time. I would give him the Petra Scarf, but we're not really going to run into any mods that like can poison, I feel. Okay, so before we proceed, I need to... I need to, like... Oh, wait, I said it. Damn. I meant place. Yeah, that way it's too it's not taking up two slots. It better not be that one we went the opposite way of. So good having the Absol on us, so hopefully if we go up against any bosses, it will help us out. Because we needed that last time before I realized I was being stupid. Finding the stairs pretty easily, so that's good. Almost a 10. Uh, I just hate that these dungeons, like, the each floor is so big. I was going to go for a regular attack, but since he used Growl, yep. Okay, good. We chose right. I always get paranoid that we're going to choose the wrong way, and then we're going to end up going the long way to the correct floor that we missed. That we go to every room except the one that we skipped, and it turns out to be the one with the stairs. We always find the Mon that picks up an item, but I don't care about the Petra Berry. We already got one. Okay. Gotta get this P first. Just Pokey! Okay, one more floor. Ooh, we found a blue gummy. Okay, that was easy. Ooh, good thing we didn't go left. wonder what this is for. Psychic type. I don't get how gold is psychic type. That makes no sense. And then the pink or the purple one's like poison. No, the pink one's poison, which makes no sense. So that's pretty weird. I don't know. For the gummies, the, the choice and like colors, I don't know. Oof. We could have gone the wrong way many times. Ah, uh, more than 10 floors. There's a Vigoroth right there. And the XP these guys are giving are way higher than the ones over there. In the last, last uh, dungeon we were out. I forget what it was called. I don't know why this, this uh, dungeon sounds exactly like the last one we were at. 
I found another gravel. Another gra gravel rock and an iron thorn, so that's good. Okay, gonna avoid that Zangoose. Okay, patch not a patch of berry. Orange berry and some more money. Ooh, if we can keep all this money without feigning, when we get back, we're gonna be able to buy every friend area. Friend zone. Oh my god, that helps out so much, the linking moves. But it also kind of... It doesn't help with the PP, though. Oh. I didn't realize we lost a freaking Absol. Oh my god. Uh, yup, that's what I was afraid of. Oh my god, it died. It just reused up, it used up our Reviver Seed. Don't use whatever move. It used Poison Tail, right? Oh my god, thank god. We gotta go back for him. Oh, it went the opposite way. Okay, we gotta hurry up before he gets killed. Nope, too late. Oh, he ran into a slack off. Fuck. Dude, we're fucked. There's no way he can take out that slack off. Oh, no, that's like all the slacking. There's one right there, too. Okay, keep doing regular moves. What level is that? That Absol's level 20 and it's so weak? Oh my god. It's gonna die. Uh, don't use any moves. Don't use Leer. Okay, we need to give him the Orange Berry now. Eat it. Eat it. Oh, that was so close. Oh, no, he used Yawn. Please, as I take it out. Yes, thank you. And I leveled up. That was so close. At least he'll be asleep, so he'll stay put for a while. How's he not asleep yet? We found the stairs. Okay, we gotta get out of here. He wasted our reviver seat. I don't even see when he separated from us. We're literally right next to each other. I don't even know how he got separated. But that is so annoying. It's like almost the same level as us, but it's so weak it died to that one hit. So I don't understand at all. How that even happened? Oh my god, this is how. Dude, we're like right here and it almost got separated again. That's gonna be annoying. Every time, that's like the that's the trend. We find a reviver seed and we can't hold on to it. We it just gets used right away. That's always the theme. That's annoying. We're at our 15th floor and we're still not there. Better be the last one. Yep. Last one. Okay, good. Because that absolute... Bro, we still got a ways to go. I don't know how long this episode is. I didn't put a timer. Uh, let's see what happens. We only got five more floors and then we're there. So, so for the best. We gotta make sure this apple doesn't get separated from us because the peak has stronger mons than the than the core of the, the dungeon usually. Oof, good thing we went left. Yeah, why not? He got teleported in front of a mon. Are you serious? No. Okay, that's taunt. Isn't that that he can only use? Okay, he can only use attacks, I think. Hold on, just hold on. Dude, the Absol is going to get me killed. I was excited that he joined us. I don't know about now. Because if the Cyndaquil had been teleported, he would have been able to handle his shit. See, look at that. No. It's already becoming a worrisome. What is this? Max Elixir? Oop, nope, we're out. I'm not trying to deal with that, Glalie. 
And then we spawn in front of a Glalie. Look at that, 157 damage. Okay, now he's at 24. Nice. Oh, wow, the Absol leveled up too. 21. Bite. Oh, hell yeah. I'm gonna take off Taunt. Useless move. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. While we're at it, I gotta take off Leer so he doesn't use that. Because he almost died because he kept using that against that Slack off. Here. I say Quick Attack does more damage than Scratch. I don't want to use up any of the gummies on the Absol because I don't even know if we're going to use them on the team eventually. I would rather give it to Mons that we're going to for sure have on the team. I'm always worried that I go the wrong way. Okay, good. We've been lucky so far. We haven't had one of those where we go the wrong way and we literally have to go backtrack the whole way across. Okay, well, there's a giant room right here, so we should be good. Okay. Chill. Still another one in here. It's clearly starting to annoy me. Okay, how much? Oh, no, I don't even want to throw those. I want to stack those. Those are much better than the gravel rocks. I need like a multiple space move. So far, only Cynical has one of those. We're racking up the money. Okay, there's a Mon over there, but I want to get this last item. Okay, good. It's a gummy. Weak type picker. Oh, that's a good one. Hopefully, the Cynical gets that. Oh, wow. I missed. Alright. One more floor. Oh, no, wait. We made it. Yes, okay, good. We made it. We finally arrived. This is the summit. Isn't it? I wonder where Nine Tails is. There they are. I've spotted Alfie. All right, I see them. Uh, Alakazam! It's about time. We finally caught up to you. Your fugitive act dragged us all the way out here. Pipe down, Tyranitar. We can finally settle things here. I can barely contain myself. I'm itching for a fight. Flamas, don't think badly of me. I don't know how to show mercy. Elfie, I didn't wish for this conclusion, but this too is fate. The role of a rescue team is to help bring peace. We will crush you with every shred of our power. Get them. We really gotta battle them? Or fight them? No. Seize this at once. Oh, there's a nine tails. What? Nine tails. What? Nine tails. That's nine tails. The legend. It was real. Seize fighting at once, El Kazam. They are my guests. Tell us, nine tails. Who was the human that appeared in your legend? No, even before that, was the legend itself a true event? Depending on your reply, I have no choice but to eliminate them. Whether they consider my curse to be a legend or not, I care not. However, it did happen. Many years ago, I tried to lay a curse on a human. It was then, however, that guard of war, the human's partner, dashed in. It selflessly bore the full brunt of the curse meant for the human. Then, the human did a selfish and cowardly thing. They abandoned guard of war and fled. 
The human eventually became a Pokemon, transform transformed into a Pokemon. The human, the human lives on, and that human would be, who is the human that you speak of? Alfie, you may relax, it is not you. Just now, what did you just say? Alfie is not the human that appears in the legend, that is what I said. What? What's happening to me? I'm too tensed up to move. Oof. 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 Deep breaths. <sighs> in. Out. In. Out. In. Out. Phew. Oh, wow. Fantastic. That's great. I knew that Alfie wasn't involved. I knew it. There's no way that Alfie would do those terrible things. I have another thing to say. It is true that I foretold of the world's balance becoming unstable. However, that human became becoming a Pokemon and the world's balance are not linked in any way. The cause of the natural calamities, it exists elsewhere. Hey, you! You were wrong. You were wrong to hound and harass Alfie. Uh, er, we, uh, apologize. We're sorry. We got worked up by that Gengar. No. I suspected Gengar right from that, from the start. Alfie just doesn't look like the treacherous type. Ha 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 ha. If only that were true. But I must say. You are to be commended for prevailing through this cruel journey and discovering the truth. Impressive, Elfie. Ha ha ha! Excellent! I knew I was right! Huh? Oh, but wait. Then why did Elfie turn into a Pokemon? I understand that Elfie isn't the human from that legend. Then how do you explain Elfie becoming a Pokemon? Elfie? Who are you? Wow, the ground's heaving. Qu quake! The world's crust is shifting. The natural calamities are worsening. And the shifting of the ground. It will awaken the beast that embodies the ground. The beast that slept deep underground. Groudon will be awakened. What? Groudon is rising? Groudon? What is that? What's a Groudon? A legendary Pokemon that has been spoken of only in myths. It is the Pokemon that raised the land masses and created con continents. It is said to have taken to sleep after catastrophic battles with its arch enemy, arch enemy Kyogre. If Groudon were to get loose, there would be chaos. It must be stopped. We will go. We'll go too. No, you must remain behind. Groudon is far more powerful than any Pokemon you have faced. Leave it to us. That's how it goes. You go back to your rescue team base for a well-earned rest. Don't worry about us. We didn't get our gold rank the easy way. We'll get the job done, and we'll be back before you know it. Fine. We're off to quell Groudon. And thus, Alakazam's team made their way underground to quell the awakened Groudon. Meanwhile, cleared of all suspicion, Alfie's team put an end to their long and arduous journey and returned to their welcoming rescue team base. I was going to say when they caught up to us as a joke. It's like, damn it, we spent too much time trying to battle that article that they caught up to us. Obviously being stupid. That, that's not the reason why. Meanwhile, back in Pokemon Square. Okay, okay, you lot. Why aren't you out there hunting down Alfie's team? That's easy for you to say. It's too much for us. They say Alfie's team has gone 
way far out there. If we went, the best we could hope for is maybe the Lapis Cave. I joined the chase, but they fled into Mount Blaze. For the life of me, I can't go in there, and that's where I lost their trail. I'm a grass type, see? Fire doesn't agree with me at all. I don't know what became of Alfie's team after that. But those fugitives, to think they would risk Mount Blaze. They've grown up tough. I can't keep up. Ha ha ha. Okay, what a spineless lot you are. You're so full of big talk. What about your team, Gengar? You just hang around in the square and don't do a thing. Walk the talk. You guys go. We're out of that picture. Okay. Our role is to receive word about Alfie's demise. <laughs> Just the point at yourself that? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Metachat, what's the word? Alfie. Alfie is... Oh, finally. We're f finally rid of that Alfie. Okay. No, it's the opposite. Alfie is back. What did you say? Hey, over there. Elfie. They're back. Hi, everyone. We're back. Phew. We finally made it back. We've been gone for so long. It feels kind of nostalgic to be back in the square, Elfie. Hey, Flamas. Hmm? Oh, it's you. Gengar, it's been a while. Okay, what's with that smug confidence? Yeah, maybe. Gengar, everything you said was completely wrong. Alfie had nothing to do with it. Alfie was innocent. What? Is that true? Yup, we met nine tails and asked. Alfie isn't the human from the legend. We are back because we discovered the truth. Okay, uh, uh. wait a second. You can't be trusted yet. If you're going to make that claim, let's see some proof. Proof? That's right, some hard evidence. Okay, let's see some proof. Come on, out with it. Proof? We don't have any proof. Well, we technically have the Absol on us, but I guess they don't see him. <laughs> it's too bad you don't have proof. You came back for us so we could get rid of you easier. How conveniently foolish. <laughs> now, fellow Pokemon, here's your chance to get rid of Alfie. <laughs> okay. What's wrong, everyone? Don't you want to be rid of Alfie? I... I always believed in Alfie. You don't fool me. I... I'm out. I was saved by Alfie's team before. I joined the chase with the heavy heart because of your urging. But I simply can't think of Alfie being bad in any way. I've heard enough, too. I believe Alfie. Yeah, that's right. Who needs proof? Everyone. Extra, extra, read all about it. What? What is this? It looks like a newspaper, doesn't it? Okay, I'll read it aloud. Let's see. Pokemon News Extra Alfie Innocent Alfie met with Ninetales under the watchful eye of Alakazam and proved that it had nothing to do with the human in the legend. As a result, Gengar's claims were found to be malicious lies and... <laughs> You rotten. Run! 
Stop, you liar, you conned us. Welcome back. Yup, it's good to be back. We're back like we promised. I'm so glad Alfie isn't suspected anymore. Yup, I'm glad too. We won't have to keep running from everyone anymore. Alfie, we're both exhausted. I'm going to get some sleep. Our rescue team gets revived tomorrow. Let's try to do our best. Yay, we're back. We can recruit Mons again. The next morning. All right, we're finally back. Back to business. So we finally got back to Articuno. Found out the truth, and now we are back at home. We can recruit Mons again, so that's exciting. We'll see what unfolds, see who we'll recruit. I might still carry around the Absol since it's high level, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed seeing me finally get past that annoying boss that should have been annoying, but I'm an idiot, but here we are now. So thank you guys very much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys all next time.